with a fall lookbook for you. You know that I specialize really in theme park wear. Like I love dressing up to go to theme parks, using small shops, using my favorite brands to create and curate outfits that are both practical while also being cute and fun for the season. For the fall, I really wanted to make something that was helpful if you are going to a theme park. Um, right now, California theme parks are still closed, but if you are going to a theme park in Florida, it's fall, but it's also really hot. Um, like here in California, it is still 90 degrees in the middle of October. Just to prepare for the heat of the days while also being cute for the theme parks. That includes outfits, masks, apparel from small shops. I thought we would go through what I have on my clothing rack right now and then share a few looks that I've put together that I think would work really well for a theme park. Going to a theme park in the fall, especially right now, can be a little weird. My goal of this video is to show you a few different looks that you can put together really easily with a few staple pieces in your wardrobe. I'm really focusing today on like a jacket or a dress or a shirt and building from that. So taking what you already have and like creating something new. So that's what we're going to be doing today is taking some pieces that I've already had in my closet and then some new ones from this year and meshing them together and making something perfect to wear to a theme park or just like around for fall. When you go to a theme park in the fall in Florida, which is open right now, or in California, it can be really hot. Um, so it's sort of dresses in the daytime to maybe pants at night, depending on the weather. So I'm putting together maybe some dresses and um, jeans looks that you can throw together really quickly. Um, and we will go from there. Let's do it. Okay, so this is my clothing rack. Um, and usually when I have my clothing rack, I pick out a few pieces that maybe are new and then pull out things from my closet from last year that I want to be a little different and like bring new life to and I'll like put them here so I imagine my outfits from this space. So I want to go through all the different things that I have and maybe create a few outfits that I can share with you and then hopefully there'll be things that you can create too and replicate for your own trips. All right, so the staple of my first outfit is this coat. I just picked it up from Madewell recently. Um, it is corduroy and oversized, and I love to wear it with jeans or a dress or really anything. It's so adorable. Um, I like to wear this with a dress because it's a little oversized and on the longer side, so it goes perfectly with this plaid dress that I picked up from Madewell as well. It's on the longer side. I love this dress. It's perfect for twirling. It has pockets. I mean, you can't, you can't go wrong with this dress. Um, and perfect for twirling around the castle or walking around Epcot. And I mean, I know that this coat might be too much for the Florida heat, but I mean, it's just so cute and I had to get it. So here we are in this coat. So I'm just gonna show it off. The coat pairs perfectly with this dress and maybe a gold necklace just to add some accent. Um, and it just adds the perfect little layer to your look for the fall. Um, my favorite thing to do is then to pair a dress with a t-shirt and cover it up. So I got this Main Street Morgan Boo To You shirt last year, and I've worn it like every day of fall this year. And I just tie it over the same dress with that same coat just to give it a whole new look. Um, my favorite mask of the season that goes perfectly with this outfit is from Stony Clover Lane. They came out with a neutrals collection and then just add a hat, you know, add a hat to give good accessory. Um, it's the perfect addition uh, to your look. And then my Doc Martens are my staple boot. I wear them with everything. Here you can see now I have some hands on with that same shirt. Um, I wear those boots with everything, same hat, same mask. It's so versatile just to have a really good staple shirt to go with everything. Um, this shirt is from Myo My Supply Co. And I mean, I'm obsessed. Look at it with this mask. Um, it says, it's freaking bats. I love Halloween because that meme is iconic. And I mean, I don't wanna wear anything else. I paired it with this Stony Clover Lane fanny pack in sand with a sand heart. Um, and still looks so good from the neutral pack of masks. Okay, this jacket I got at J. Crew. Um, it was 40% off. I'm obsessed with it. And um, I'm never taking it off. L this outfit makes me feel like I'm going to a pumpkin patch. 
It's super lightweight and I just got it because it was on sale and it has this cute daisy um, print underneath the corduroy sleeves and collar, which I love. Um, I paired it with these snakeskin boots from Madewell I got last year that go so perfect for fall and that just completes the look. The key is to just pull favorites from things I already had and then combine them with a few key new pieces like this freaking bat shirt, uh, my boot to you was from last year, and then using my same shoes I already had with some new coats just to mix it up and you know, you got the best fall wardrobe ever. You just combine what you love and some new things and it's perfect. So that's all I have for today. Thank you so much for following my channel and subscribing. I'm so grateful for everyone here, um, especially if you made it this far. So thanks for sticking around. If you try to use any of these looks in your own daily routine, please let me know, tag me, share with me. My Instagram is at Tinkerbell. You can find me there for more theme park style. Um, and I look forward to seeing you soon. Bye.